Hey guys, Touch Computer Help here today, and so, as you can see, my iPhone is on the screen right now. This works for iPhone, iPod, um, most on iPad, and this is all for versions 3GS, 3G, 4 for iPhone, um, version 3G, uh, and version 3 and 4, excuse me, for iPod and iPad 1 and 2 for the iPad. So, as you can see, it's jailbroken, figuring the fact that I can move that up and down, so I could have that, you can see the layout's different. The dock down here scrolls, and you get Cydia. So, I'm just going to show you guys how to do this, and then hopefully you'll be able to see some other things um, on how to make your device a lot better. So, open up your device, and let's go to jailbreakme.com. I'm sorry, I can't show you guys how to exactly do this all completely for the reasons that then I'll probably have to end up restoring my device and that's probably something I don't want to do alright so this page should be coming up and what would end up happening here is if you read this it'll basically jailbreak your device they're not responsible for anything that happens or goes wrong blah 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 you can void your warranty um so basically with this basically you it's almost like going to the app store all you gotta do is just go here tap on free and then just tap on install again and it'll simply just install on your iPhone iPod or iPad like it would like you're installing an application so to prove that I am currently running the newest device um, here I'll go into my settings to show you and there we go as you can see right here version 4.3.3 in parentheses 8J2 that version and my carrier uh, carrier as you can see is AT&T and so you can see that I actually do have everything that a normal phone and the fact that it is a phone would have so let's go back and I'll show you Cydia on here. And if you notice up at the top how my loading bar has changed, for some reason it does not seem to work correctly when you go into Cydia or some other devices. So you can see right here it welcomes you to Cydia. And so you can see that it all works out perfectly fine um you do running the new newer devices you do get all these little um upgrade packages that you have to do like every other day for a few days until it does stop they don't want to just force it all at you at once apparently so you can just get all the packages i'm pretty sure you would know how to but I'm just going to go through it with you once you first get it you would want to do is sorry I'm just scrolling through this so I can find it um, go into section and then just find the one that says respiratories and then find the one which there shouldn't be all these um, just find the one that says Steph Wiz and once you get that go ahead and find the one that says all sources that will allow you to get 
most of these sources that are right here that are currently working to get a bunch of free city apps that you usually pay you would want to go to H um, edit under manage in the sources file and then go to add and then you want to go HTTP colon slash slash X sell these dot com slash Cydia and if you don't know um, what I said there and you can't see it right there the one the first one with the little question mark right there um, above the ZOD TTD you'll um, there will be it in the description along with some more information about it so let me just go back to my packages and show you guys what I have so far you'll automatically get app sync for 4.0 plus if you have your devices on the new 4.3.3 or above 4.0 you can get if you're running iPhone you can I recommend this strongly you should get from X uh, Sle uh, Sleazy sorry about that you should get the Byte SMS which is pretty good actually um, for it and you'll get oh here's the system configuration files the GUI-GPG-SEC that is what updates every few days um, you can so let's get on with the rest of this um, let me find it you can get InfiniBoard which allows you to um, have more than the standardized I think it is let's see 4x4 four four. it will allow you to add more on there you can get oopsies sorry about this you can get InfiniDoc as you saw when I was going to my hacks folder it allows you to set a certain amount of icons on each page and you can also get infinity folders which I will show you in a second and so you can get a bunch of other things make it mine changes the um, carrier and you can change the date like my carrier now says my name um, you can get open SSH the SSH into your device which I really recommend if uh, something goes wrong with your device you'll still be able to usually um, VNC right here this will be another in, uh, tutorial will allow you to do the same thing you see seeing my device right on the screen and then winterboard that will be a whole nother tutorial so let me just quickly show you the infinity board I have all my games usually you have 12 icons in here so let's go ahead and look how many I have 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 24, 28 and the standardized Folder is usually 12, so that shows that would be right here. How it's showing would be how many applications you would usually get in a folder, but with the jailbreak for the infinite uh, folders, you will be able to go unlimited. So that's all I have for today. Um, questions, comments, uh, feel free to message me or send me a video, whatever you're comfortable with. And if you would like to see a video or a video um, on something you're not too sure about with iPhone, Windows, Adobe, or any Windows-based or Apple mobile device-based software, feel free to leave me a message. Comment, rate, and subscribe.